What I love about working with steel is that it's that is it has a timeless quality to it. It's just a very cool material. It's it's incredibly strong. It's easy to work with. It's relatively inexpensive. You can take a a pile of square tube and sheet metal and angle iron and make it into something beautiful if you're so inclined and and uh, you know, when left to its devices in this environment, it develops a beautiful patina that can last for decades. Every client's different. Um, I start with, you know, brainstorming with them to see what they want to want to accomplish. I work with them with their style, their their what their environment looks like, their personality. Sometimes I'll try to incorporate the the weld into some of the design, uh, almost treating them like little rivets like around the perimeter of a panel or the perimeter of a gate. Um, it's important to me that you kind of see how it was made. I don't like grinding the wells off because I, I think that that process is part of the, I don't know, it's part of the artistic process, the, the, the putting together of pieces and it's important to to kind of show how those pieces were put together and, and we, you, when you see that you have a better idea that it, you know it's made by someone's hands versus a machine. Um, I do some wind chimes. Botanical panels of which there are 12 different designs. All, all are native to Arizona um, and most specifically the Sonoran environment. I've made uh, multiple you know, furniture pieces for people. I've made light fixtures. You know, I'm, I'm open for almost anything. Um, as long as it incorporates uh, a level of creativity and design and, and isn't you know, something that you've seen before. The most rewarding part is when I, I, make some, I collaborate with a client, make something for them, install it and see it in context in their, in their backyard or their environment or whatever and, and I know that they are completely satisfied. That's probably the most rewarding part.